Did you know that the root cause of your autoimmune disease could be from Candida overgrowth? Specifically Candida albicans is a common fungal pathogen that can be found right in our digestive tract. It's usually harmless, cohabiting peacefully with other microbes in our bodies. However, our immune system plays a critical role in maintaining the balance and keeping Candida from overstepping its boundaries. This is where our immune system's innate and adaptive components come into play. Neutrophils, a type of white blood cell, and macrophages, a kind of immune cell, are key players in our body's innate immunity. When Candida or any other pathogen tries to invade our tissues, our immune system releases chemicals to attract neutrophils. These neutrophils neutralize the invader and then transform into what we call apoptotic neutrophils. Macrophages then step in to engulf these apoptotic neutrophils, preventing any further tissue damage. In this way, our bodies ensure that Candida is kept in check. But here's a thought to ponder on. What happens when this balance is disrupted? When Candida grows out of control, it can lead to a variety of health problems, and most concerning it can be the root cause of autoimmune diseases. So, how does this happen? Picture Candida as a common resident of our gut, usually living in harmony with other microorganisms. However, when it overgrows, it can trigger our immune system to overreact. This overreaction can lead to autoimmune reactions, where our own body's immune system starts attacking healthy cells. Let's delve a little deeper into the role of T-cells in this scenario. T-cells are a type of white blood cell that plays a pivotal role in our immune response. There are several types of T-cells, including Teeth1, Teeth2, Teeth17, and Treg cells. Each of these has a specific function in our immune response against Candida. Now, when Candida overgrows, it can confuse these T-cells. The T-cells will then start attacking our own body's cells, mistaking them for the Candida cells. This confusion and overreaction is how Candida creates an autoimmune reaction and disease. Speaking of autoimmune diseases, certain conditions like rheumatoid arthritis and Crohn's disease have been linked to Candida overgrowth. In rheumatoid arthritis, for instance, the immune system mistakenly attacks the joints, causing inflammation and pain. In Crohn's disease, the immune system targets the digestive tract, leading to a host of digestive issues severely damaging the gut microbiome. So you see, an overgrowth of candida can disrupt the fine balance of our immune system. It's like a domino effect. The candida overgrowth triggers an overreaction of the immune system. This overreaction leads to autoimmune reactions, and these reactions can lead to autoimmune diseases. In a nutshell, a candida overgrowth can disrupt the fine balance of our immune system, can severely damage our gut microbiome, and cause many different autoimmune diseases. Thankfully, there are ways to neutralize candida and reduce the risk of autoimmune diseases. It's all about balance and nurturing our gut health, which is where the battle against candida begins. Our digestive system is home to a complex community of microorganisms, together known as the microbiome. A diverse microbiome is a healthy one, as it can effectively keep opportunistic pathogens like candida at bay. Promoting microbiome diversity can be achieved through a balanced diet rich in fiber, fruits, vegetables, good healthy fats and proteins, and fermented foods like yogurt, sauerkraut, and kimchi. These foods feed the beneficial bacteria in our gut, strengthening our internal defense against candida overgrowth. In addition to a healthy diet, it's essential to eliminate factors that encourage candida growth. It is strongly encouraged to completely cut sugars and processed foods out of your daily meals, as candida thrives on these. Stress management and adequate sleep are also crucial, as they contribute to a healthy immune system that can effectively prevent candida overgrowth. Taking good probiotics is a must if you want to stop candida from becoming a problem in your gut microbiome. These supplements contain live beneficial bacteria that can help restore balance in your gut, helping to replenish and maintain a wide variety of good bacteria. They work by outcompeting candida for resources, thereby preventing its overgrowth. It's a good idea to consult with a healthcare professional for personalized advice on probiotic supplementation. By taking care of our digestive health, we can help keep candida in check and reduce the risk of autoimmune diseases. So, the link between candida and autoimmune response is a complex yet fascinating one. To recap, candida albicans, a common fungus in our gut, can trigger an autoimmune reaction if it overgrows in our gut microbiome. Our innate and adaptive immune systems work together to neutralize this pathogen, with key players like neutrophils, macrophages, and T-cells. But remember, balance is crucial. 
Overreaction can lead to auto-inflammation, while underreaction might result in candidiasis. Boosting your gut health by promoting microbiome diversity can help keep candida in check. Do you suspect the cause of your autoimmune disease might be candida overgrowth? It's more common than you might think, and if you've tried it all before to help your symptoms, this might be worth discussing with your healthcare provider and test for candida overgrowth.